I'm in AX and I'm in the inventory management menus and we've always had the ability to do journals to do an inventory adjustment or counting to adjust a quantity of inventory and stock um, but what about in the new warehouse um, if we want to use the mobile device so let's have a look at an example I'm going to go into release products and I've got a uh, an item here that I've been working on and if I have a look at the stock I don't have any inventory left in this particular location and in this particular case this location is not license plate tracked um, so whatever adjustments you do you'll have to conform by the dimensions that you need to specify for uh, this product so let's go and have a look at how we can set up an adjustment in the new warehouse management so if we go to the warehouse management menu and if we come down to setup you'll see where we've got inventory and we can specify adjustment types so we can specify here the, the name we give it and then the related journal in this particular case the um, inventory counting journal to do the adjustment now for the person to use it on the mobile device we need to set up the mobile device menu so let's go and look at the adjustment in so I'm going to go and create a new menu here and I'll call it adjustment in and this is work um, but it's indirect work so you'll see here for example um, uh, that it's um, a menu item they can specify which is adjustment in and then I can select the relevant uh, adjustment type in this case adjustment in now I've got some other options if I need to default data or if I am wanted to generate a license plate I could do that so once the menu is created we can go and assign that to a menu I'm going to assign that to a main menu back here and in this particular case I just created a folder called adjustments and I've put that under the main menu so let's go and grab our new menu which is adjustment in I'm going to add it to our menu so we've got an in adjustment here on the menu so let's go and log on to the mobile device now in this particular case the stock I want to adjust in a different warehouse so I'm going to go and change the warehouse so that we're working in that warehouse and then I can go to my new folder which so here's my adjustment menu so I can specify the location stock 2 in this particular case I can specify my item number and in this particular case it's batch controlled so I'm going to specify the batch and then I can specify the quantity so in this case 20 and then we can say OK so what we've then done is done the adjustment so work completed for the adjustment if we go and have a look at the on hand inventory now we'll filter on this particular location and refresh so we'll see that we got 20 in physical inventory now so the values that you specify here will depend on how the item set up and how the location set up um, so in this case I didn't have license plate but if this because this location is not license plate tracked if it was then I'd have to specify license plate so that's a quick walk through uh, doing an adjustment of stock in to the uh, warehouse location via the